Okay, so if you click on one of these dishes, we will see that the buttons on the navigation bar still has the Apple default buttons. So now let's try and see how we can customize this button. So this is actually very simple. Going back to our app delegate, we can customize the the background on those buttons using our UI appearance APIs as well. So if we say those buttons are UI bar button items, so let's say UI bar button item that also implements the appearance protocol. And we'll say set background image. So we'll call this image the back. No, actually, that button is called the back, the back button. So we need to have set a back button background image. Yeah, that's that one. Say back button image. Let's use the normal state. And then we'll use the default bar matrix state as well. Okay, so what do we do? So now we're still missing this back button image. So going back to our resources as well, we have a very nice button for the back button. That's that one there. So this is basically a transparent image with a border around it. And then the text will be in here, of course. So if we make that smaller and then go back to our application and say, So now we're gonna have to give the name of the of the image, and that is back button the PNG. So let's run that. And if we click on the list, we'll see that we've customized our back button image. So that's looking good. If you click on that, it disappears. If you can, like, it comes back in. It's looking good. It's looking good. So, what do we do now? Next thing is to customize or actually style this detail view. It looks too boring for me. So, that's going to be the next thing we'll do. And that's going to come in the next video.